Something I like to do is at impact is feel that my hands and club head are in line at the same time at impact. So I see some people trying to lead with their left hand. The left hand is leading, the face is open. Well, you're gonna end up hitting more shots to the right or topping the ball. Then I see a lot of people who try to flick and then the club head gets in front of the hands. So then the club head's not in line there either. So we have very, very inconsistent impact positions. So something I like to feel is hands and club head together. So if we get a feel of, say if at home, if you get a bit of a, a hitting bag here, all right. Just softly feel that the hands and club head are coming into impact at the one time together. When you feel that right hand hit at impact, you'll compress the ball much easier. Club head and hands together, and then hit through there. Yeah. But what about casting? Whenever I try to feel like I'm extending my hand, I'm, I'm kind of like casting. Well, generally casting is because you're out here because of a weight shift. So that will come back to every other drill of trying to get that first movement right. So, so through here, if we can get the feeling that we're hitting club head and hands together at impact. Okay, so we don't want to get in front of the ball and have our hands in front. We don't want to stay behind the ball and cast and come out to in. Come out to where in that way. Where do you put the, uh, the back in front of you a little so bit? Basically put the bag in line where the ball should where be. Where the ball is. Okay. Ball position. And when you get that, then you go to the actual golf club. Feel your impact position same way. Yeah.